Thanks for being with us for the news at 11 here. Tonight's school board meeting was the first since the local four defenders dropped a bombshell report. A night school principal says she was shoved out after investigating a number of claims of teachers having sex with students. Mar McDonald live in Pontiac tonight. Uh, not everybody's buying those claims, Mar. No, they're not, Devin, and those claims are all coming in a lawsuit from the former principal at Pontiac High School. She details them, claiming that she was told that students were being sexually assaulted by staff members. Now it's up to the Oakland County Sheriff's Department to figure out exactly what's going on here. What was going on at Pontiac High School? If you listen to former star wrestler Efrain Ortiz. I never did an assignment my 11th grade year and 12th grade year in her class. Ortiz says that's because he was having sex with his teacher and that's not all. He claims an assistant principal was having sex with three different female students, not for grades, but to make sure their family's food stamps weren't taken away. This man was holding over food stamps uh, for, the, for the family in order to get sexual favors. I mean, it's an outrage. I mean, it's so outrageous that you need to report it and uh, to have someone try to cover that up to, to me is a crime. Attorney Greg Roll has filed a lawsuit on behalf of former principal Dr. Vanessa Carter, who was investigating these claims and says she was shut down. I took the information and reported it immediately to my um, assistant superintendent and called the chief of security in to also review the information so that we can determine next steps. Carter doesn't know if any of this is true. What she does know is she was moved out of the high school. Her bombshell lawsuit prompted a big turnout at tonight's school board meeting. I'm here not to slander the school district, but to say as a private citizen, not an elected official, that I do not believe these allocations. Rutherford knows the teacher Ortiz is claiming he had sex with for two years. Do you believe any of that? Absolutely not. Tell me why. Because this is a teacher who goes above and beyond the call. She doesn't have an opinion on the veracity of the allegations against the assistant principal. She believes the school district investigated but says bring on the Oakland County Sheriff and lay it all out. I can say that Mike Bouchard is going to do his due diligence because he believes to have an open transparency. So I believe that. I don't believe they're going to find anything. Back here live, the three things tonight that need to be answered. Number one, were these students sexually assaulted by staff members? Did the school district investigate these claims? And three, did they alert law enforcement to what these claims are as they are required to by law? At least tonight, it does not appear that any law enforcement agency was made aware of what these allegations are. We are live in Pontiac tonight. I'm Mara McDonald. Back to you.